You're watching Best of the Bluegrass at the Barbasol Championship. Welcome back to the special edition of Best of the Bluegrass from the Barbasol Championship at Champions at Keene Trace. You know, this event is more than just a golf tournament. It's giving back to the community in a lot of ways. Lauren Vernon joins me now. She's a board member with Caddy 127, which has given back hundreds of thousands of dollars. What is sure. Caddy 127? So Caddy 127 was birthed out of the Barbasol Championship. Every host site of a PGA Tour event, um, the tour allows for the community to designate local charities to give money back to. So Caddy 127 is the umbrella name for six local charities that we funnel proceeds and awareness and marketing to through the Barbasol and all year round really. We can see a list of the charities behind mm -hmm. you and these are wonderful organizations yes. and they're all right here in the bluegrass so the money is going back to help people in the bluegrass. It's true all local money um, we added a local charity this year Sunrise Children's Services. Um, our goal with Caddy 127 was to pick local groups that impact women and children in the community so it's just been neat to come alongside of these organizations and a little bit goes a long way for these local groups so this has just been a dream for them and for us just to learn about what the needs are in this area and how we as a club and as a tournament can come together and walk alongside of them all year not just tournament week and fans out here have an opportunity too to learn more about these charities we're yes. here just by the clubhouse you have a tent set up where yes. people can go in and meet the people that are behind these great groups please do come meet because they are set up here you'll walk in through the main entrance and you will hit our caddy 127 corner and all representatives will be here learn about these awesome causes anything that people spend on site it goes back to these people all Ultimately, so it's really special. That's fantastic. Yes. How can people learn more about Caddy 127 and also how can they help you? Well, we hope they come to the tournament. So we're going on all weekend. And then if you want to get online and go to caddy127.org, you can scope everything out right there too. So really cool. We are so excited. We're so privileged. Uh, one out of 52 in the world. The Barbasol Championship, the only PGA Tour event in Kentucky, held at Keen Trace Golf Club in Jessman County. And golf club owner Evan Mossbarger says the privilege goes well beyond the game of golf. When we started this program with the PGA, one of the first things they told us was, you get to keep your money in the community and you get to make a difference in the community. This golf tournament is cool and everything like that, but it's really a vehicle to be able to help our community. Caddy 127 is the charitable arm of the Barbasol. It helps support and raise money for six nonprofit organizations helping women and children in Central Kentucky. Refuge for Women was founded in 2009, and what we do is we provide a safe place for women who are escaping sex trafficking. Ked Frank founded Refuge for Women, one of the nonprofits supported by Caddy 127. They provide safe housing, work training, therapy, and so much more to help women recover and heal. We just give them a, a place that's filled with love and hope and, and hopefully just uh, send them out into just a whole new opportunity in life. They do all this on a 53-acre farm in Garrett County, and their mission to rescue women from sex trafficking has expanded to six other locations around the country. You hear about it, and it's a horrific thing, but it's not something that you think necessarily is here or that you know, you'd have a role to, to play in helping end it. We started realizing that there was something that we could do to help. And, and so just through a series of events, we decided that we felt like this is something that we needed to, to get involved in and, 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 and pay attention to. The partnership with the Barbasol Championship through Caddy 127 is something they are so grateful to have. Not only are people learning about that we're here and that we're, we're helping women and ways that they can get involved, but certainly the partnership of of the, the resources, the volunteers, the awareness, and just such a great event, a national event like this, to be able to be a part of it is such an awesome thing. Just like a caddy is to the golfer. Golf was meant to be played with a caddy. Somebody to walk alongside of you, to help you, to encourage you. The idea is that no one should walk alone. And supporting six nonprofits in Central Kentucky is taking a big step toward achieving those goals. Reporting for Best of the Bluegrass, I'm Angie Bevan. Pro golfers from the Barbasol Championship give back to former and current patients at Kentucky Children's Hospital. Eli Gain takes us to Kroger Field for the annual mini Pro-Am. It's my turn. It's my turn. Okay. Let's see it, buddy. 
It's an unbelievable part of the week because you go to the golf course and you focus on your work, you focus on your game, and then you have an opportunity to um, to be with the community and to meet awesome kids um, and put a smile on faces and um, show show them that golf can be fun. We got uh, the football players and the cheerleaders out here as well, and it just creates a really cool thing to do. And um, it's you know what what it's what the PGA Tour is about. There's certain things that go along with uh, winning, winning out here on the PGA Tour, and you give back, and uh, you get to do special events like this, and come out to Children's Hospital and see the kids, and uh, you know just try to put some smiles out there, and see, and they put smiles on our face, um, you know, just their bravery and their strength, and uh, battling through their their uh, situation, and um, just anything we can do, uh, the money that we raise with charity, anything we can do to help is uh, just just amazing. Yeah. Yeah. Yay. yeah, no, it's great. It's, you know, this is what it's all about, just giving back to the community, helping out kids. I mean, I was a kid, we were all kids, right? And we all dreamed of, of doing this. Um, and, and this is a huge part of it. I mean, we wouldn't be playing for the money that we play for and having the opportunities to, to make the careers that we do uh, if we didn't give back to the community. I think that this is the cool side of the PGA Tour that uh, as well as the corn fairy that not a lot of people really realize and see um, is, is you know coming out and, and doing things like this in the communities and giving back to kids and, and people um, and, and the PJ Tour prides itself on that and so um, it's an honor and privilege to, to help out and be a part of it. You don't have to be a golfer to dress like one. Birdies and Bows in Lexington has the latest looks you can wear on and off the golf course. That's next on this special Barbasol Championship edition of Best of the Bluegrass.